Okay, so we're gonna jump right in because we don't have much time. Of course, man. And how excited are you for Krypton? Over the moon. I'm over the moon. Like I had high expectations for the show coming in. Now that we've we've made a lot of it. It's gonna be special. I'm super excited about it because it premieres four days before my birthday, so that oh, means I have great. a celebration. Awesome. Well, think of it that we made it just for you. I like that. And then, okay, so we know that kryptonite is Superman's weakness, yeah. right? Yes. And you're 200 years prior to where the altercation happens. What's your weakness, though? Uh, well, for the character Segel, I think the interesting thing is that his weaknesses are just sort of where he is as a person. You know, we're all flawed, and and I think the interesting thing about the show is it isn't a superhero show in the sense that there are goodies and baddies in the in the traditional sense. Not everyone is fully formed. There are there are moral shades of gray here, and and Seg, as much as he's trying to run towards something, he stumbles and falls as much as the rest of us, especially when the fate of, of Krypton is on his shoulders, the, the fate of the legacy of Superman is on his shoulders. So I think, you know, he, he, he's rash and hot-headed, but he's going to have to grow to fill that symbol. Yeah. yeah. Obviously, I want to dive in more, but we don't have the time. So thank you for even stopping for a question. It's my absolute pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you. Yeah.